GIZ has been in the business of promoting solar powered irrigation for quite some time now. So today we are visiting um, Nduku's farm where we set up a solar powered irrigation pilot system. It comprises of a basic solar powered irrigation setup. So we have the solar panels. In this case, we have a, a 600 watt solar panels. Those are two modules of 300 watts each. And these are powering a, a, a submersible pump. It pumps the water up to the tank. Um, that's a 10,000 liter tank. And then we have the drip line system, which now feeds the crops. One of the reasons why we uh, wanted to work with Magdalene, um, the criteria for eligibility was really met. There's good water source, there's good uh, availability of land. Uh, she has been a farmer. She has been doing the farming for quite some time. So by the time we got here, we could actually see a few crops uh, on the field. Ukulima nilianza kama 30 years ago. Nalima skuma, spinach, kojet na kitungu. Niliona kulima bila machine itakuwa ngumu sababu ningekuwa natumia hii maji ya kunyunyusia na mtungi ama nabeba na kibuyu sasa nikanunua mashine ya kupump maji ndio nikaanza kupump maji na na, 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 na hiyo ma, machine ya, ma, ya mafuta vile nilikuwa natumia hii mashine ya petroli nilikuwa napata tu mazao lakini sio vile sana ni sababu nilikuwa natumia mafuta kama ya alfu ina hivi kwa mwezi lakini mazao ikokuwa mzuri vile vile sasa nimepata hii machine ya sola ina nimenisaidia sana ni sasa napata mata, mazao iko juu kwa vile sasa kama ni nyanya napata na elfu mia moja, ishirini hivi ya uh, uh, Skuma inakuwa kama 8,000, kitungu imekuwa kama 50,000. Saa inaendelea kuwa juu saidi. Niliku, hii motor pump haingeweza kuchukua eka moja. Saa hii kwa hii solar machine natumia eka mzima. Na inanisaidia sana sababu na hiyo naweka kwa hii, hii drips. Hiyo inakuwa na inachukua mboga. Kama ni mboga ni mingi kuliko hile nikuwa na, na panda na 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 water pump eh yeah. saa mazao yameongezekea hapo sababu hii ni kubwa kuliko vile nilikuwa naweka na, na machine na water pump another cost saving which came apart now from the savings that she no longer you know the, the cost that she now long experiences in terms of petrol was the maintenance of the petrol pump this used to break down a lot according to what she, she told us and she had to take it to the Tala center to get it fixed this was a very um, expensive uh, recurring cost. So she no longer experiences that. In terms of the, the, the technical experience, since the commissioning up to this particular time, there has been no issue whatsoever with regards to the system. There has been no leakages. The pump has been operating optimally. Um, the installation of the panels, of course, allowed for self-cleaning. And so far, she has not uh, indicated any technical issues with regards to the system. During the installation, of course, we also took her through a maintenance um, training whereby we, we, we informed her about few routine maintenance aspects which she needs to observe. Vile nilikuwa natumia mafuta. Saa hii natumia kidogo. Saa nilikuwa natumia elfu ine kwa mwezi. Saa hii natumia kama elfu mbili, miatano. Na sasa hiyo pesa imenizuwezesha kuongeza hata mazao kwa mboma yangu nimenunua sungura nimeongeza kuku na nilinunua ngombe ya kulima tuko sako ya tala tala tunakujanga tuesdays na fridays na siku ya leo nimechuna sukuma na nimeleta hapa tala Sukuma na uzanga kwa shilingi kumi, na shika kipande hivi kwa shilingi kumi. So ultimately, um, this system has really um, worked towards uplifting her well-being as, as, as a farmer and also allowing her to extend the benefits to, to, to the community. Nime shukuru kwa hiyo system, anataka kama inawesekana, muniongese kwe 
kubwa ya saidi ya hiyo.